Johannes Toller Opp c. 1300 to 16 June 1361 was a German mystic, a Catholic preacher and a theologian. A disciple of Meister Eckhart, he belonged to the Dominican order. Toller was known as one of the most important Rhineland mystics. He promoted a certain Neoplatonist dimension in the Dominican spirituality of his time. Topic: Life. He was born about the year 1300 in Strasbourg, and seems to have been the son of Nicholas Toller or Tawiller, of Finkweiler, who in 1304 was a member of the Strasbourg Town Council, entered the Dominican Order at the age of about 18, and was educated at the Dominican convent in that city. Meister Eckhart, who greatly influenced him, was active in Strasbourg c. 1313-1326, though it is unclear what relationship they may have had. It is possible that while taking the customary eight years course of study at the monastery he heard Eckhart preach. From Strasbourg he went to the Dominican College of Cologne, and perhaps to St. James's College, Paris, ultimately returning to Strasbourg, but more probably he returned from Cologne to Strasbourg. Around 1330 Toller began his preaching career in Strasbourg. The city contained eight convents of Dominican nuns and perhaps seventy smaller Beguini communities. It seems likely that, as with Meister Eckhart and Henry Suso, much of his preaching was directed to holy women. Most of Toller's nearly 80 sermons seem to reflect a convent situation, although this may partly reflect the setting in which such sermons were most likely to be written down and preserved. In 1338 or 1339, the Dominicans were exiled from Strasbourg as a result of the tensions between Pope John XXII and Louis of Bavaria. Toller spent his exile c. 1339 in Basel. Here, he became acquainted with the circles of devout clergy and laity known as the Friends of God Toller mentions the Friends of God often in his sermons. Evidence for further connections with this group is found in the letters exchanged between the secular priest Henry of Nordlingen and his spiritual friend, the Dominican nun Margaret Ebner. Through Henry, Toller also became acquainted with Mechthild of Magdeburg's flowing light of the Godhead. Toller worked with the Friends of God, and it was with them that he taught his belief that the state of the soul was affected more by a personal relationship with God than by external practices. In this way, he was more of a proselytizer than his counterpart. Eckhart, Toller returned to Strasbourg around 1343, but the following years brought various crises. Strasbourg experienced a devastating earthquake and fire in 1346. From late 1347 until 1349, the city was ravaged by the Black Death. It is said that when the city was deserted by all who could leave it, Toller remained at his post, encouraging his terror stricken fellow citizens with sermons and personal visits. Toller traveled fairly extensively in the last two and a half decades of his life. He made several trips to Cologne. A number of his sermons were clearly delivered there, as indicated by their survival in the Cologne dialect of Middle High German. A credible tradition suggests he visited John of Rusbroek in Gronendal at some point in the 1350s. He is credited with composing the words of the Advent song, Skommt ein Schiff, Geleiden. The oldest existing text source is a manuscript dated before 1450, found in the Strasbourg Dominican convent of St. Nikolaus in Undies, which Toller was known to have visited frequently. There are also some stylistic similarities to his other writing. According to tradition, Toller died on the 16th of June 1361 in Strasbourg. He was buried in the Dominican church in Strasbourg with an incised gravestone that still survives in the Temple Neuf. The well-known story of Toller's conversion and discipline by the friend of God from the Oberland cannot be regarded as historical. Topic: <laughs> Sermons. Toller leaves no formal treatises, either in Latin or the vernacular. Rather, he leaves around 80 sermons. Toller's sermons began to be collected in his own lifetime. Three 14th century manuscripts date from around the time of Toller's return to Strasbourg after his exile in Basel. Toller's sermons were printed first in Leipzig in 1498, reprinted in 1508 at Augsburg, and then again with additions from Eckhart and others at Basel, 1521 and 1522, at Halberstadt, 1523, at Cologne, 1543, and in Lisbon. 1551. A Latin translation was printed first at Cologne in 1548 and 1553. 
In the 19th century, editions were produced by Julius Hamburger, Frankfurt, 1864, and Ferdinand Vetter, Berlin, 1910, reprinted Dublin, Zurich, 1968. Toller was famous for his sermons, which were considered among the noblest in the German language. Not as emotional as Henry Suso's, nor as speculative as Eckhart's, but rather intensely practical, and touching on all sides the deeper problems of the moral and spiritual life. Toller was one of several notable Christian Universalists in the Middle Ages, along with Amalric of Bena and John of Ruysbroeck. He taught that, "...all beings exist through the same birth as the Son, and therefore shall they all come again to their original, that is, God the Father." See also List of Latin nicknames of the Middle Ages, doctors in theology Toller Modern editions There are various foreign language editions of the sermons Ferdinand Vetter, Die Predigten Tollers, Berlin, Weidmann, 1910, Photomechanical Reprint, 1968, is based on only a few manuscripts and does not adhere to the proper liturgical order of the sermons. It lists a few variant readings, but lacks an apparatus of sources. Several of its sermons are not authentic. A complete French translation exists as E. Hugony, G. Therry and A. L. Corin, Sermons de Toller, Traduction Fet sur les plus anciens MSS. Alamans, 3 Vols, Paris, 1927-35. Georg Hoffmann, Johannes Toller, Predigten, Freiburg, Herder, 1961, Reprint, Einsiedeln, 1979 provides a helpful German version, but not a critical version of the Middle High German text. Johannes Toller, De Preken, a complete Dutch translation by Peter Freens 2015, Toller A good English translation of Toller's sermons is lacking. Spiritual Conferences by Johann Toller, Op. 1300-1361, Trans Aris College and Sister Mary Jane, Op. New York, Herder, 1961, Reprint 1978, contains a rather loose translation of sermons and excerpts of sermons from Vetter. It rearranges that according to theological headings rather than keeping the order of the sermons themselves. Johannes Toller, Sermons, translation by Maria Schrady, introduction by Joseph Schmidt, New York, Paulist Press, 1985, translates 23 sermons, but from the modern German edition of Hoffmann, not directly from the Middle High German. The version also contains various omissions and errors, and lacks notes. Older English translations of Toller include various inauthentic pieces, and were often made from the Latin version of Laurentius Sirius. They are therefore problematic. These include Catherine Winkworth, History and Life of the Reverend Dr. John Toller with 25 of his sermons, London, Smith, Elder, and Comp, 1857, available at http colon slash slash www.ccel.org slash cell slash Winkworth slash Toller Meditations on the Life and Passion of Our Lord Jesus Christ, translated by A. P. J. Cruikshank, London, Thomas Richardson & Son, 1875 available at http colon slash slash www.cell. Org, CCEL, Toller, Meditations The Following of Christ, translated by Junior Morrill, London, T. Fisher Onwin, 1886 available at http colon slash slash www.ccel.org slash cell slash Toller slash following the inner way, being 36 sermons for festivals by John Toller, translated from the German, with introduction, by Arthur Wollaston Hutton, London, Methuen & Co., 1901 available at http colon slash slash www.ccel.org slash cell slash taller slash inner underscore way topic further reading Davies, Oliver, God Within, The Mystical Tradition of Northern Europe, London, DLT, 1988, pp. 71-78. Eck, Suzanne, Gott in UNS. Hinführung zu Johannes Toller. Übersetzt von Victor Hofstetter op und Hildegard Stoffels Dominikanische Quellen und Zugnis BD, 8. Leipzig 2006. Nadinger, Louise, Johannes Toller. Lebenswelt und Mystische Lehre, München, 1993. Hamburger, Jeffrey F., D. Verschiedener de Gen Bucher der Menschheit. Johannes Toller über D. Skivias H's V. B. Trier 2005 equals Mit, U. Vers, Aus D. B. I. B. L. D. Biskoffel. Priesterseminars zu Trier, 20. 
Lepin, Volker, Article Taller Johannes in Theologische Rielenzyklopädie, BD 32, Berlin, New York 2001, S 745 to 748. Mayer, Johannes G. Die Vulgata Fassung der Predigten Johannes Thalers. Würzburg 1999. Texte und Wissen 1. McGinn, Bernard. The Harvest of Mysticism, 2005, pp. 240 to 296. Mosch, Caroline F. Das Dichu Gebert Geschichte. Meister Eckhart's Predigtzyklus von D. Eugen Gebert U. Johannes Thaler's Predigten zum Weihnachtsfestkreis. Freiburg 2006. Otto, Henrik, Vor und Frühreformatorische Thaler Rezeption. Quellen und Forschungen zur Reformationsgeschichte BD. 75 Gutersloh 2003. Sterlis, Loris, Thaler im Kontext. Die Philosophischen Voraussetzungen des Seelengrundes in der Lehre des Deutschen Neuplatonikers Berthold von Musburg. In, PBB 109, 1987, S390-426. Thion, J., Taller und die Liturgie. In, Deutsche Mystik im Abendlandischen Zusammenhang. H. G. V. W. Haug und W. Schneider Lasten, Tübingen 2000, S409-423. Weigand, Rudolf Killian, Predigen und Sammeln. Die Predigtanordnung in Frühen Taller Handschriften. In, Studien zur Deutschen Sprache und Literatur. F. S. Konrad Kuhns. H. G., von Werner Williams Krapp. Hamburg 2004, S. 114-155. Denifel, Dis Buck von Geislicher Armuth, Strasbourg, 1877, Karl Schmidt, Johann Toller von Strasbourg, Hamburg, 1841, von, Robert Alfred, Hours with the Mystics, 3rd ed., Vol. I pp. 214-307, Wilhelm Pregers Jesch, Der Deutschen Mystik im Mittelalter, Vol. E, W. R. Ng, Christian Mysticism, R. M. Jones, Studies in Mystical Religion, 1909. Joel Dana, Johannes Thaler. Dottore Illuminato e Sublime, Symmetria, Roma 2006. Topic notes Topic References This article incorporates text from a publication now in the public domain, Chisholm, Hugh, ed. 1911. Taller, Johann. Encyclopædia Britannica. 26 11th ed. Cambridge University Press. Loeffler, Clements 1912. John Taller. In Herbermann, Charles. Catholic Encyclopedia, 14. New York, Robert Appleton Company. Joel Dana, Johannes Taller. Dottore Illuminato e Sublime, Symmetria, Roma 2006. Joel Dana, Una Introduzione alla Mystica di Johannes Thaler, in Revista di Ascetica e Mystica, n. 1, 2009, pp. 139-148. Joel Dana, La Teologia della Perfezione in Johannes Thaler, in Perennia Verba, n. n. 6-7, 2002-2003, pp. 181-200. External links The History and Life of the Reverend Dr. John Toller of Strasbourg, with 25 of his sermons in English archive.org Johannes Toller in the German National Library Catalog Works by or about Johannes Toller in Libraries WorldCat Catalog Die Predigten Tollers im Digitellen Mittelhochdeutschen Textarchive der Universität Trier Johannes Toller Biographisch Bibliographisches Kirchenlexikon BBKL in German. Ausführlich Wörtigung Tollerdruck von 1621, PDF Beschreibung von Mittelalterlichen Handschriften MIT Tollerpredigten im Marburger Repertorium, Universität Marburg Godfriends, the Continental Medieval Mystics.